Hello everybody, today's video is one that I am tired, literally at the mere thought of. We are shopping for jeans today. I have quite a few boxes and packages behind me to get through, so I'm not doing my normal sit down as I normally would on this channel. I am just gonna get straight into it, trying everything on, because otherwise this video is going to be exceptionally long. Shopping for jeans is hard enough already without you having to sit and listen to me for an hour, so yeah, we're diving straight in. If you are new to my channel, hello, I'm Susie. I make fashion videos here on YouTube. YouTube. and I would love it if you wanted to join us here for more videos you can hit subscribe and I upload videos roughly every Monday and Thursday if I've got one. Now that we've got those bits out of the way let's jump right in. First up I will link the last shopping for jeans video I did it's probably slightly redundant in terms of the items but you never know Zara do like to bring things back quite regularly. The last video I believe was pretty much all Zara today we are doing Zara and ASOS. I did also order some more expensive jeans to compare they haven't arrived yet and it's, it's been a while and I just thought Oh, screw it no one actually wants to pay 300 pounds for a pair of jeans anyway so we're just going to do zara and asos and i'm pretty chill about that so last time when i did this video i was i think looking mostly for like mom style jeans i had lost a bit of weight and basically none of my jeans fitted anymore so i was replacing a lot of old mom jeans i found an amazing pair that i'm still wearing and loving right now i actually wear them unrolled and as more of a straight leg jean and i love that but i did want to have that kind of style of jean but in a few more colors so i would love it in in a like dark blue kind of like vintagey color i saw this photo which i'll put here of emily ratikowski i believe that's how you say her last name and i love that kind of style of jean i wanted to do it a little bit looser to be honest but i really wanted something like that for summer to style up with like a white crop tee and a tan belt i thought it was a really cute look i also have a pair of jeans that i'm loving from zara at the moment which are more of a wider leg they're kind of like somewhere between a straight and a wide they're not super like flare down but they are fairly baggy but they're not quite a boyfriend jean because they're like so beautifully tight around the waist and I think they just do a lot for my figure so I've actually ordered those in a few more colours as well so we'll see how we get on with them they are also raw hem which I am obsessed with because it means that I can just cut them to my height which brings me to the next point before we crack on and I start just like throwing jeans on my body I'm five foot two for height reference and I am generally an extra small or a small I kind of sit in the middle especially with Zara size with most other high street retailers I would say I'm more commonly an eight so there's still a little bit of room and I normally take a size small in other retailers so an eight or a small but yeah if I've done that in this video and I'm saying that like things are loose don't be surprised because I do just sit in the middle at the moment I think that is going to be it for my little intro let's get into it so the first pair of jeans these are from Zara these are more of a straight leg, I believe. Yeah, I really liked the color of these. I think these are gonna be quite fitted. I got a UK eight and they were 29 and 99. I'm just obsessed with the color of these, but let's see how they fit on. Okay, these are the jeans on. I really like these ones. I don't have a pair of mom jeans in this color and I'm just obsessed with the color basically. They fit really well. I've done a little squat test in them to make sure I can sit down. Does anyone else do that? Just to make sure things are gonna be comfortable when you sit down in them or is that just me yeah very happy with these i think we're off to a good start zara jeans are just my vibe as well i always tend to get on really well with them which is why i literally push them so heavily in these videos because the quality of them is amazing they've always lasted me really well and they fit me really well as well which is rare because i have quite a small waist compared to my hips so shopping for jeans can sometimes be a bit tricky because i find most jeans just don't have enough space for my hips and my arms basically but yeah they look really good with trainers as well which makes me very happy because i don't need to dress up smart very often so i always want a pair of jeans that look good with my trainers but yeah just to show you the length for reference this length will work really nicely when i wear my trainers as you could just see they kind of meet at the perfect point they're not too long not too short so yeah i think these might be a keeper i'll give them a nine out of ten i would say the sizing could be slightly roomier just slightly roomier but that's just my personal preference but in terms of like a nice basic straight leg jean these are perfect you can't go wrong okay next up we have the high rise full length which are my favorite style of jean at the moment i have them in this color blue and i wear them so much like a ridiculous amount i saw them in black and i was like yeah that is going to be an absolute like imagine with my black body and then a like nice little black belt the gold buckle my trainers like literally any kind of trainer converse dunks any kind of chunky trainer works so well under these but i could also wear them with like a flat sandal like a tan flat sandal in the summer these are just going to be a great all rounder and even going into like next winter i'm gonna invest in some kind of like puffer jackets that are a bit more cropped so that i can still wear these i think they suit 
a crop style jacket or like a crop style shirt layer with them really well but they also work really beautifully under like a wool trench coat type thing as well for winter the only thing is they are very 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 long but they're raw hem so you can just trim them down which isn't too difficult either i don't really worry about whether it's perfect or not because no one's down at your feet looking at your hem of your jean anyway as long as you don't botch it too badly you're all good yeah i got these in an eight and a size 10 because black dye generally tends to make items come off a little bit smaller so i'm going to try on the eight first and i'll let you know my thoughts fingers crossed amazing the eight fits i am shocked <laughs> shocked to my core i'm very confused by this because i ordered these in a dark blue i think i reordered them again but in a size up i ordered these before in an eight i believe in the dark blue and they did not fit they were so i couldn't get them done up it was in one of my recent zara hauls where i bought the jeans they just didn't fit i mean they're so long let's ignore that but i think they're actually looser than my blue pair i'm confused i can't tell if these are almost a little bit too baggy it's a bit too much room, but maybe when I take them, I don't know. They're not as tight on the waist as my blue ones. Like my blue ones are like, I'll show you, I'll do a cutaway of my blue ones so that you can see them. Because actually, if you haven't seen those jeans on me before and you're looking for an amazing pair of jeans that are like wider leg, they are the best jeans. But yeah, these have a lot of, like I have no gaping on the back of my blue ones. It's almost like these are made to sit lower down, but obviously that's not happening with me because I've got wider hips and a shorter waist. Like it's gaping at the back and that's really annoying. Maybe I can belt it. Hang on. So it's much better with a belt on. Like it's all completely fitted, but there is a lot of excess material that's like bunching up underneath the belt, which is a bit annoying when it's jeans because it's much thicker than like a pair of trousers. Let me know, what do you guys think? Would you keep them? They're getting like a seven out of 10 for me at the moment, just for the fact that they are inconsistent to the other pair I have and they're the exact same like product code like I thoroughly checked this. The fit inconsistencies are a little bit disappointing. Also the fact that the seams are a little bit rippled is weird because my other ones aren't really like that. But yeah I really like the overall look and I think with like trainers and like a white shirt tucked in even with like little crop tops in the summer I get so much wear out of these so yeah I'm gonna watch the footage back and I'll make a decision, but they are getting like a 7 slash 8 out of 10 for me. Okay, next up we have the same jeans but in the white. I love these, I'm so happy with them. The fit, as you can see, is much better. There's no like material poking out at the back. They fit exactly, I would say, as my blue ones do, which is great. These in the summer with like a tan pair of flat sandals. They all look so cute. Also with trainers, they'll look really cute for the spring, for now as well, and going into autumn, especially with like a tan or a black belt as well. These would just look so cute. I'm really happy with them. They feel really soft as well, which is nice. I think I'll get a lot of wear out of these. I love, love, love white jeans. Oh, and for reference, I got these in a size eight and they fit really well. They're really comfy around the waist. They're not too tight. Yeah, very, very happy with the fit. We'll definitely be keeping these. I'm gonna give these a 10 out of 10. And these are definitely staying and I'm gonna chop them right down this afternoon okay so next we have a mid-rise flare which i actually don't remember putting in my basket i may have put this in by accident instead of the dark blue version of the previous two pairs of jeans these are not raw hair but you could easily just cut along the bottom if you needed to adjust these to your height they are a bit more of a like flare at the bottom and i don't love that i'm also not a huge fan of the mid-rise if we're doing like a wider leg either these get like a five out of ten for me i'm not really into them i love the color i love how like old school it is but yeah not loving not loving oh and for size reference by the way these were a size eight and they were 29.99 so that's those and then we have this like straight leg or higher rise pair of jeans which i am actually really into when i first put them on i didn't have shoes on and i was like mm. I'm not sure, but actually I put my shoes on and I'm like, yeah, this will look so cute with either chunky trainers like these or like my high top Converse underneath. I think that would look really cute and kind of like 2006 like skater girl vibes. I really like these. The high rise is really nice. They have a little bit of room, but not too much. Like the fit is good. I would give these a nine, a nine out of 10. I don't know why I'm not giving, oh, I do know why I'm not giving them the extra point. They <laughs> have like the five buttons that you have to do up if you want to pee so that's why they're not getting a 10 and also just like gut feeling yeah i think i prefer the lighter blue but i do love how old school this kind of dark 
blue color is. Okay, so we're moving on to the ASOS bits. I did pick up some similar pieces to the Zara items, and that's because I kind of wanted to, I wanted to compare, contrast and compare, you know? Oh, these are gonna be long on me. You know when you just look at something, you're like, I don't think this is gonna fit very well. So these are a waist 28, 30 leg, yeah, that's why, that's why. But I could cut these on the bottom and trim them to size, but basically I wanted like a nice, oh God, I can already tell by where the crotch is falling that this is not gonna go well for me. My body is so short, FYI, like actually my legs are short, my body is short, but like my body being short has a, is a real issue because jeans are always like, like an actual really high-waisted pair of jeans would like come up to under my boobs and like high rise will just, come up so much higher, but then my waist will start going in where the jeans aren't designed to be going in and it's all just a disaster, you know? Yeah, basically I just really wanted a pair of white or off-white straight leg jeans to wear with like a black blazer and like a cute pair of flats during the spring. I'm gonna try these on just for the lols, but this is not gonna go well. Dean. Oh no. <laughs> so no, this is not good. I could belt them. Let's see. I don't think many people would give a pair of jeans that don't fit this much time, but I like to see if I can make it work. I don't know why. It comes part and parcel of being short. You learn to try and make it work. Okay, it's better, but they are a bit baggier than I was hoping. I was just hoping for like a little bit nipped in, you know, just even over the bum. And then it goes into like a more baggy, I don't know. It's probably just because they aren't actually, they're a waist 28. And actually I don't think I should be buying a waist 28. I think I actually need to be buying a 26. So it's probably just a terrible piece of ordering on my part. And maybe these would look really cool if I actually had them in the right size. Yeah, these are getting like a four from me at the moment, but maybe I should be giving myself a four because I don't think I did a good job at ordering. Okay, so these are the new look Adelaide wide leg jeans. I got these via ASOS. I don't think these were in stock on new look and they definitely weren't in stock in petite which is really annoying because they come in petite i'll try and link them hopefully they're available again by the time this video goes live because that would have been absolutely amazing i think they would have fitted like a dream but sadly they were out of stock when i was pulling everything for this video but yeah i got these in a size eight and they're very very similar to the wide leg pair that i have from zara they fit almost exactly the same so if you prefer new look over zara this might be a good option to look into, but they aren't raw hem, so you're gonna have to make them raw hem if you can't get your hands on the petite. I also believe they come in regular and tall, so I feel like this is like a good pair of trousers to look into, just on the whole, if you want a pair of wide leg white jeans. I keep saying trousers, really got trousers on the brain at the moment, I was shopping for trousers the other day. But yeah, a very, very good option if you are looking for a pair of wide leg jeans. If anyone's wondering why I just have my socks on and I'm like not showing you what half of these look like with my trainers on, it's because the wide legs, if you don't trim them to your height, just look like this. And they look insane. But yeah, I'd give these like a, a 7 out of 10, just for the fact that they obviously don't fit me, but if they did, I'd probably be giving them like a 9. I don't love the fact that they're thinner. That's my only thing that I don't love. Apart from that, I think they're great. Whoa. These fit so nicely. I, I have no words. <laughs> I love the fit of these. They fit so well. This is what I'm talking about, like that kind of like bum skimming. When I say like the other straight legs, I would like them to be a little bit less baggy and just a little bit more like and then I really like these. I might have to keep these. They are very similar to my Zara ones that I already own though. I love that they're raw hen so that I can trim them down slightly if I want to, but overall the legs are really good. I don't know if I need will necessarily need to. Oh God, I love. The fit of these is so good. If you like my Zara ones, but you don't want to bother cutting them down, you need these, you need these. And if you're someone whose waist is like very small compared to your hips, you need to get involved with these. These are so good. These are a 10. These are a 10. And I just have to keep them. Okay, so these are a bit of a wild card because I typically don't get on with a cropped flare, mainly because I get them and they hit me at a weird point on my ankle, but these are a petite pair, I believe from Stradivarius. I got them in a size, I think it's an eight, because it says 36 on the label. When I unboxed them, I was like holding it up to myself like, there's no way this is gonna fit me. But actually, they fit really, really well. Super like comfy, 
could easily like sit down in them, no problem. But yeah, they pass the squat test really well. They're nice and high waisted. The actual hem like needs a little bit of work because they've obviously been like folded and flattened for so long. But yeah, the length on them is really good. I really like a style of jean like this, especially like evenings out with like a little strappy heel. I think they look really cute, but also with like a flat slider, they look really cute in the spring summer as well. Yeah, these are a wild card. I wasn't like, I didn't have them on my list. I wasn't expecting to like them, but actually they fit well and i have been pleasantly surprised by that so yeah let me know what you think shall i keep these they weren't on my list is my only thing but yeah i feel like they fit so well and i would get a lot of wear out of them with like a blazer over the top these shoes i could switch to a tan slider in the summer what do we think so i've got a pair of the levi's 501s the 90s version and i love them and they would be a 10 out of 10 if I had actually ordered them in the right waist size. I used to wear a waist 27, so I naturally thought, yeah, that'll be fine. Back in like 2014, I was wearing a waist 27. <laughs> Maybe they're meant to sit lower, like here. Maybe. But my crotch is like a million miles away from where it's meant to be. However, I would love these in a smaller waist size because they just are such a cool fit and the leg length these are a leg length 30 but the leg length is really good on me I'm, I'm sure they're probably meant to finish like a fair bit higher up your leg but i really like them i really really like them i just wish the waist <laughs> actually could took me but yeah i really wanted to include a pair of levi's in this video i love levi's jeans and it felt rude not to pop a pair into the order considering i was shopping on asos and they do a lot of pairs of levi's on there i've always had a pair of levi's jeans in my collection and I really like them, I really rate them, I think the quality is great and I love the fact they do do half sizes so for example this is waist 27, that is not a normal measurement and I've always really appreciated that they do that so yeah I just wanted to give them a shout out for that if you do struggle and you are between sizes it's definitely a brand to look at for jeans if you can get into one of their stores their stores are really great and the staff have always been really helpful to me in terms of like trying on jeans so yeah it's a shame about the uh, waist size but overall these are a really cute pair of jeans and I would recommend them I'd give them like a 7 out of 10 just because I'm not actually seeing how they would really look if they were in my correct size but I would definitely recommend these I think they're really cute oh sorry I just have to retract a point for the fact that they have the buttons I forget Levi's do that it annoys the crap out of me so these are the Stradivarius straight leg jean in the black I really love this style of jean. I really liked the look of it on the website and trying it on, it fits exactly as I expected it to. I would really recommend this style, especially if you have a similar body shape to me. I feel amazing in these jeans. These are great. I'm tempted to keep these to wear with heels because they'd be the perfect length for me with a little heel on. Yeah, I love how tight they are around the waist and then how much space they actually have around like the hips and bum and how they fall. I think it's really flattering. They're tight around the waist, but there's still like a little bit of excess material here for if I'm like a little bit bloated and I really like that. This style of jean gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Like I was not expecting them to be a 10 out of 10. I was expecting to like them, but I wasn't expecting to love them. But this style of jean is one that I highly recommend if you're looking for a more wide length style of jean. I'm really, really into it. Also, sorry, I'm not done yet, but I have to say, I know a lot of people don't love this style of jean, but as someone who went through her most insecure phases of her life in the years of skinny jeans, I am delighted that like straight leg and like a wide length, anything that is like skimming over my hips and my thighs, I am so, so happy that these styles of jeans are back because it just feels so nice like don't get me wrong i love a legging and you know skinny jeans do have their uses i love them in the winter when i want to tuck like something into a boot and i don't want there to be too much excess material that is amazing but as someone who was a teenager when skinny jeans came in and you had your one pair of jeans that you wore to death and ballet flats were in at the same time you were wearing skinny jeans and ballet flats and it just wasn't a look i am just so enjoying this like wider leg trend is so relaxed a lot more comfortable i don't worry so much about if i look bloated because it just doesn't show as badly i don't know i just i i'm here for it i'm really here for this style of jean yeah sorry if you're not at least there was a couple of straight leg options in here but on that note if there's any particular styles of jeans that you would like me to shop for vote in the comments and the most requested i will do please do not say skinny jeans because uh, it's not gonna happen or would you like to see me pick a color and then shop a variety of different styles 
that is also an option. Let me know what you prefer. Okay, last pair. Sadly, these are a little bit big for me. I'm not sure what size I ordered these in, but they're huge. These are the ASOS Reclaimed Vintage Light Wash Wide Leg jeans and i love the color of them i can't remember who i saw wearing a pair of wide leg jeans that was in this color but i was like oh yeah obviously i love a wide leg and i love this color like my favorite pair of mom jeans are in this color they're really nice and like baggy i don't know if that's just due to the fact the sizing is wrong or whatever but they feel like the pockets feel really roomy which i feel like is really unusual on a pair of jeans these days they feel very like skater girl-esque and i really like that they're a little bit long i think i probably have to chop the hem but if you are a little bit taller than me and you're looking for like a wide leg, I would really recommend these. These are really, these are really lovely. They're a little bit thinner than most of the jeans I've tried on, but not too thin. And they've still got that like slightly rough denim texture, which I really like. I just think they're so nice. These would be amazing for summer with like a little white crop shirt or like a body and then like an oversized shirt and like a bucket hat, which is a look I love. I've actually put that on TikTok last night. It was a really cute outfit. Yeah, really love these. If these had fitted, I would have given them nine a nine because of the length but my minus point for the leg length is someone else's plus point so yeah okay so guys don't forget to let me know which jeans were your favorites in the comments happy shopping if you are starting the journey of shopping for jeans it's one that i put off for so so long but i can honestly say that having a wardrobe with key denim pieces that i'm so so happy with has honestly changed the game for me in terms of like getting ready every day my style is much more basic now but it's because i genuinely am so happy with like a body and jeans in varying different styles just something that i am very passionate about and that's why i decided to start making these videos and helping everyone find a perfect pair of jeans i hope you guys have enjoyed this and i will see you guys again very very soon love you bye